in a bid to develop a pool of ideas flowing to develop the Federal Capital Territory. The FCT administration, through the Reforms Coordination and Service Improvement Department, has floated a platform for interaction with retired directors where transformational strategies can be discussed and shared. The FCT Minister, Barista Yesomwike, who was represented by the Acting Permanent Secretary, Mr. Samuel Atang, emphasized the significant roles the retirees had played while working in different sectors. We came into the civil service very well guided by rules, regulations, by procedures and ethics that were handed down to us by all of you seated here. The mentorship we had from all of you here have helped, really, really helped to shape the course of our career over the years. And I was quite happy when the Director of Reform Coordination and Service Improvement informed me of the plans to create a platform to unite our senior citizens so that we can tap from their wealth of experience and knowledge. I was very pleased with that. The Acting Director of Reforms Coordination and Service Improvement Department, Dr. Jumai Amadu, earlier described the contributions of the retired directors as invaluable. Come you and look forward to continuous meeting that will ultimately make our young officers know the value of dedication. That is what is lacking, which is why the department thought it wise to ensure that we have few great minds that have contributed. When I heard somebody said he was FCTA staff in 1971 or so, I was just taking that back. So he has a lot of information that we can tap in and ensure that we do the right thing as young officers in the service. Joy Igochi, ITV News.